Congratulations, Jeffrey. What, 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 a, what an amazing game. I mean, you've just beaten Michael Van Gogh and Adrian Lewis. Confidence must be sky high. Oh, the confidence really sky high. You know, I'm, the dream is still going on. I mean, what was what was the aim when you came here? I mean, did you really think sort of like you could you could go all the way? Well, well, there was no aiming. You know, that I qualified was already a dream that came true. And you know, um, there was no aim. And I think that's that's really important for me. There's no aim. You know, I can do what I want and. I can still believe that, that I maybe can win one. So, so what you're saying is there was no pressure, no expectation on you? No pressure, no expectation. I don't want to get pressure on myself, you know, and just want to play like that. Absolutely. I mean, what, what an amazing game, because at the first session, 4-1, and then sort of like, and then Adrian came back. What were you thinking when Adrian came back? I was thinking, stop now. <laughs> no, 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 but, but Adrian played really well at the, at the end, you know. He, I thought he's getting from from 70 average to to one 103 so it is getting really back and at 10 9 i was thinking come on one leg come on keep pushing for one leg and then 94 uh, amazing well, i mean what a fit. i mean you, you missed those three darts at tops didn't you for the match before and then sort of but is it in some ways easier to go for like a combination finish because you're not just focusing on the one dart it's more about a rhythm isn't it i guess the, the combination yeah, yeah the combination is like like winning and and the feeling has to be there you know i was standing on 94 i just think about myself trouble 18 don't go for the ball work. i've hit the single 18 and then i said to myself on give it a shot and it went in yeah I was going to say, there's other ways you could have done 76, isn't there? You could have gone treble 20, double 8. But do you always, if you're on 94, do you always go double double? I always go double double, much of the times. Yeah. I mean, it makes sense because the target's bigger, isn't it? Uh, yeah, the target is bigger, and you know, you have to get confidence when you throw for it. And then I just said to myself, go for it, and it went in. Okay, good stuff. And I mean, um, so you, I mean, you've just beaten two great players. You must think you can beat anybody now, Jeffrey. Of course, I, I'm always thinking that, that I can beat everyone. You know, I'm not scared of anybody, and that, that's really important. David Chisnell next. It looks like it's going to be the best match ever, isn't it? It could be. Yeah, he played really well the, uh, today, and um, yeah, it could be a tough game. Um, maybe a lot of 180s uh, played uh, each other uh, a couple of times. You know, and uh, yeah, it could be a good game.